Hi everyone, this is Angel Wings Tarot back giving you another reading. Today I want to ask, what is your next blessing? Okay, so let's just get into it. I'm gonna, thank you. Two cards here, two cards. You pick between which card you want for pile one, pile two. We have the North Node, love it. Then we also have Mutable. North Node, pile one, Mutable, pile number two, okay? destined to have love it and then we have surrender fluidity and welcoming change okay so whichever one resonates with you the most go ahead and pick it the timestamps are in the description okay so let's just get started i'm gonna pop you over here mutable and then we'll get into the north node i love so this video has to be kind of quick because i don't have all the time in the world right now <clears throat> what is your next blessing pile number one the north node so this is something you need to know you're destined to have this is just straight up you're destined to have it nothing in the world can stop this from happening because it's yours gathering around the power of community Ooh, ooh. are you guys gonna be the many masks authentic self you guys this is so cute look the power of community the authentic self there's something about your true purpose being standing out being within the community others are gonna look up to you so this is i'm getting like career this is your blessing i have the needle intentionality you've been weaving at this you've been creating it like a dream so let's get some more energies angels what is pile number one's next blessing whoa okay what is their next blessing for pile number one ah oh look you have the hunter and then you have the eternal child okay so isn't that just crazy <sighs> i'm getting a few messages okay and you got the underworld oh my god <laughs> wow okay i'm getting like healing but with this hunter and the eternal child it's like you're going back to self here so some of you could really be working in careers that you have dreamed of since you were a young child. You've been chasing, you've been working, working, working. It's finally coming in. But I just get this sense of people are going to look up to you for who you are inside with this energy of the inner child. Because you've worked hard. People are noticing this. It's not the time to dim your light anymore. Now it's the time for you to shine. And that's what's coming for you next, pile number one. This is your destined for this destined written in the stars like some of you literally are meant to be out here working with people inspiring influencing people helping others to get out of the darkness there's so much light that is here and i feel like you bring people together pile number one and that's why you're being gifted this beautiful blessing you have relationship change oh my god there's also a message that a child could be your next blessing so take it how it resonates yeah, look, relationship change, eternal child, and then you have health there on the back. So for some of you, if you're looking to have children or anything like this, yes, you're going to have this child. <laughs> you are destined to have it. And that's what the angels are saying there. Moderation, something to do with health as well. So if you've been struggling with health issues or whatever, expect those issues to improve. Okay, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. You've got some sort of blessing coming in. It's going to improve your your health. Wild one. Oh, look, wild one. The eternal child and solar eclipse. This is like revolutionary, to be honest with you. Even this looks like you see the sun in the middle. You've got the solar eclipse picture here. And the wild one. So there's something about you unleashing your creativity and just showing and expressing yourself for who you are that's going to be that's going to lift you up like you're gonna be getting some sort of recognition for it which is amazing okay um let's get into the tarot okay let's see what else what is pile number one's next big blessing I feel like you're not gonna have to chase anymore this is gonna be literally handed to you on a silver platter and the, the universe is gonna be like you're welcome <laughs> it's so nice okay the wild one so yeah go crazy go crazy that's too much is it no it's not okay yeah okay so we're seeing here we have the star we have the lovers we have the king of pentacles and the king of wands don't play oh my god oh my god sorry <laughs> Some of you guys could be getting married, alright? I'm seeing that. Some of you guys are going to be working with someone 
to what you're going to create with the star energies and king of pentacles right two different messages you can be working with someone that's really going to like um build you up like there's something about not like selling you but they're gonna like help you direct your energy i don't know something about this like investing in you that's what i'm getting that's what i'm getting invest in you you're building something or you within yourself you are building this and you're being very good <laughs> at building it a lot of stability security good decisions logical decisions you are growing this dream okay i'm seeing that and you're putting a lot of creative energies into it ultimately it's going to bring you so much love and recognition fame wow and yeah marriage or commitment i'm here in contracts you could be signing a contract with someone but literally you're on your king shit here because you have two kings the star and the fucking lovers and the magician bro oh my god some of you are going to be getting like some news about a work like i feel someone is going to reach out to you you might be on a platform or something right someone is like yeah i'm gonna reach out and i'm gonna hand this person this opportunity here this is gonna open up a door for you you've got judgment underneath that you're gonna have to make a decision on if you want to take this offer or not but i'm seeing it's yours to make that judgment call it's something you're destined to have so um yeah you are the wild one you are the star you are the eternal child this is a blessing in a half oh my god so i'm seeing love here I'm seeing children and I'm seeing something amazing happening within like your career. Seven of Cups reversed here. It's you're not going to need to second guess yourself over if this is the right choice for you. You're going to know. I feel again like this is something you guys have been chasing for so long. Six of Swords. This next blessing is you moving on in life. You're moving on to the next phase. This could be um, even moving house or relocating somewhere. I'm seeing that. It's like your dream is going to take you somewhere. You have the hunter here. You might have been chasing, chasing, chasing. But you don't need to do that anymore. Because I feel like you're here. You've arrived. You've been delivered. What's pile one's blessing? We've got the queen of wands reverse. And she kept coming out. I'm getting an interesting message that you're not going to need you won't need to do all the work alone anymore that's another blessing for you it's like you're gonna have support you're not gonna be burning yourself out anymore yeah the tower with the two of cups Ooh. okay so someone might have a surprise love offer someone in the past that didn't want to give you anything they are currently like getting the strength to get her to come towards you and give you this offer right i'm seeing that two of cups with the tower this will be surprising for you it could catch you off guard pile one's next big blessing yeah someone's got an offer they're walking back to you right now they're planning things the wheel of fate guys with the hang you see the hanged man there this is gonna be like an enlightenment for you i feel like if you've been in the dark about something your next blessing, everything is coming out into the light. Like, there is no way this shit can just hide anymore. And yeah, some sort of elevation of status within your community. And moving on, you're going through a portal, you're transcending, you're leaving the old behind. And I see you really embracing self-authenticity, you know, this is radical self-love. And you're going to be loved for it, okay? So... I love this pile, pile number one. If this resonated for you, let me quickly get you a few angel oracles to finish. And then, yeah, if you if this resonates, please let me know in the comments. I love reading them and you can leave a like because it always helps the video a lot. So, abundance. You guys are going to be rich. You guys are going to have everything, like all your needs tended to, okay? Lovely. <laughs> Healing. You're going to be healing. So if you've been suffering with health issues, suffer no more. You've got new love coming in for you and focus. You're going to be able to focus. So I feel again like some problems you've been having, they're not going to be issues anymore because this revelation is coming. Forgiveness. Wow. 
You could be forgiving someone from your past, forgiving someone in your life, forgiving friends, family, and seeing it. And you have Archangel Michael. So I'm feeling as well like just super healing energies, enchantment, breaking away from old curses, spells, anything that was leaving you feeling stuck. Archangel Michael is here with his fucking sword. And he's like, ah, you know, he's like, no. We're not doing that shit anymore, okay? So that's what the angels want you to know. You are healing, cleansing, and attracting so much abundance into your life. Because the more you put love into this eternal child, the more it's just attracting. So keep up whatever you're doing. And thank you. I will see you guys next time. Bye. Hello, pal number two. Thank you so much for joining me here. I am Angel Wings, and let's get into your reading. So... You have picked the mutable energy, the mutable card. So I definitely feel you guys are in for some huge transform transformations. It says surrender, fluidity, and welcoming change. So you guys are getting prepared to welcome something really grand into your life, okay? Whoa. <laughs> Did you see everything just flew from my hand? And we got the swan. We got, look, the lover the sword and the castle i'm getting protection vibe something has been something has been protected for you you're about to walk into these changes right so you might be called upon right now to be very careful about who's around your energy and what is coming in and what is leaving your life right because this is an energy of change but i'm getting a very distinct what you're about to walk into has been held for you you have Alethea, you know, this is yours and you're going to come into the knowing, you're going to come into the knowledge that this is yours and what is yours does not go by you. I'm getting, you may have had to fight for this or you felt like you had to fight for this. That's not happening. The, the fight is transforming into surrender. Yeah, look, look what fell on the floor. Protecting the future. You cannot make it up. I can't cope. Dragon's Horde, and I was getting some super water energy, so you could be a water sign, right? There is water in this picture. You see how beautiful she's holding the water and letting it flow gently from her hands. All right, I just heard some of you let something go. Some of you let love go. We have the lover here, but something's coming back. You release something, right? This is what the angels are saying. You release something, and because of this action, this sacrifice, this surrender you've made... Uh, something's coming in now to take the place that was, you know, empty, that you, <clears throat> you released it. Beautiful. Look, it's yin. Oh my god. Didn't we have yang energy for the... No, that was another reading. I'm just being silly. Never mind. Never mind. Um, but yin energy, receptivity, and it's exactly what we just said. Let me read this shit. Intuition, trust, patience, spirituality and receptivity didn't we just say because you you released okay and now you are in this energy of holding your hands out you're being faithful and you are allowing what is yours to come and just take its place naturally this is why you're being rewarded oh my god guys i'm happy for you honestly my heart is like really happy so let's see and we have the castle beautiful houses moving um abundance you're going to be treated like a king, a queen. You know, I'm seeing that. Someone's going to fight for you. Oh, someone's going to fight for you. Okay, relationship change. This came out in pile number one. So go ahead and watch pile number one. It was, look, you got love and relationship change and completion. Oh my God, you can't make it up. You guys, I'm just going to take love. You know what? Fuck it, because that's spiritual partnership right underneath that i can't cope with all of this the messages is so much thank you angels we love you we know you're the best right away look at all this blue okay you got protecting the future you got relationship change and then you got love and you see all of the blue because you're gonna have communication with an, a lover could be an ex-lover okay or, or a water sign. I'm just getting all this water, all the blue, all of this energy of, you know, flowing, okay? Oh my goodness. This was, this was big. More energy, please, angels. What is pile number two's next big blessing? What is pile number two's next big blessing? This has been held for you. Oh my god. Pregnancy. Oh god. 
So if you don't want pregnancy, then don't claim it. <laughs> Be very careful. Holy sugar. Let me reshuffle these because they went everywhere. So, yeah, you, you could be with all this love energy and receptivity. So, mm, um, what is happening for pile number two? What is their next big blessing, angels? What is pile two's next big blessing? How much time have I got? Let's see if we can get this done. Vaginal canal. <laughs> oh, my God. Vaginal canal. You cannot. Like, what the fuck? Number 44. These cards are amazing. Oh, my goodness. And we have Fox right on the deck. I don't know. Maybe your your next big blessing is some JJ. Okay, I don't know, man. But we had pregnancy. We also have Fox. We have labia. We have all the, the vaginas coming out for you guys. <laughs> Maybe you're into that, okay? <clears throat> Let's get into the tarot, though, and just see what it is. Angels, can we know? There's a lot of water, so sexual energy for sure look we got death coming out okay this is also water energy it's scorpio so yeah a lot of wet wet water water coming out for you guys maybe this is something you've been wanting okay but i do see communication and i'm also seeing this is something that's been put aside for you so you may have had to go through some sort of struggle or fight this next big change is just gonna be like releasing you from that again and you're going into you're not going to be in this gray, um, shit <laughs> energy. It's going into the beautiful, colorful energies of creation. Look, someone's coming to tell you the truth about something. Could be a Scorpio or a water sign. The lover's reversed. <sighs> My lord. Angels, what's going on? Pile two's next big blessing. Yeah, you're going to have truth over something that was very clouded in your mind for a long time with the moon reversed. So, all secrets are being revealed. These, these next changes, you got completion coming out, right? And I'm looking at this vaginal canal and seeing the perfect circle, right? And it's like, there is a completion energy here. This is the end of a cycle for you. 656 you can google that for some angel number messages <clears throat> for what is next coming your way but love and relationship change this is very direct you have the page of wands it was reversed i feel like someone before they weren't taking you seriously or you vice versa you know mutable energy could, could have been both parties but let's just see nine of cups wish fulfillment you've been praying for this you've been wishing for this feel you've been struggling with things like for a while like there's been a lot of frustrate frustration in your life magician wow someone is working hard to manifest this new begin this love look lovers this new love with you so definitely pile two you're gonna have some love soon <laughs> if you're single you know yes it's coming you have a page here more water energy someone wants to come and just open up I'm seeing honesty with the magician as well like there's an empowerment energy so you can expect to hear from this person soon or these changes will be coming in quite soon i feel like you are very much in alignment right now and there is the energy of yin and receptivity is something that will definitely help you align with this love and this relationship change you don't basically you don't need to do anything so chill <laughs> i'm seeing that king of cups okay more water Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, you could have an older male or whatever. I'm seeing brown hair, like, in my head. Someone with brown hair, male, it could be older than you, younger than you. They have, yeah, more water. <laughs> you could dream of this person a lot. Didn't we say that? I can't remember. No, this was in a different... Re never mind, never mind. You may dream of this person a lot, though. Four of Swords. They could have hurt you. You had to recover from them. And yes, I see you moving away from any instability or insecurity in your life, right? This is a healing energy. This is someone coming in to literally heal you and open you up to new energies that will help you and help you advance. Anything else, angels? I need to go in a momento. For lovely pile two, what's their next big blessing? Some of you though, kids, family, pregnancy... Nine of Swords healing. Look, you, you guys are healing. There's been something troubling you. It's like an infatuation. It's it's love. It's love. It's this relationship, right? 
this relationship that broke down, Ten of Pentacles reversed, is now going to be restored. I'm feeling like something had to be rebuilt. It's like they had to break something down and then um, just for this new structure to be able to take place. So this has been a very strange process, I feel, for you guys. But there's going to be six success coming in with that energy. I'm going to put you there because we love it. No more of this grief. Your angels are saying, no, no, no. We're here with the love. We're here with the changes. And all you need to do, baby, is keep holding out those hands and receive. Receive, receive, receive. Because we have all the love to give you guys. Okay, one more for luck. And then I'll get you some oracles. And I'm going to head off. Look, Queen of Pentacles. You guys are going to be really well taken care of. This is total abundance coming in and giving you a kiss on the forehead, you know? And also the resolution of conflict there as well. So I see someone that really wants to take care of you, pile number two. <clears throat> and I'm also seeing you are going to have a glow up, okay? Because you're feeding yourself the right things now. You're watering yourself. Romance. I love. The angels are not playing. Romance and healing. Okay, so someone... And look, it's got Eros and Psyche in the picture. You can go and Google the story of Eros and Psyche. It's very beautiful. Eros is Cupid, God of Love, Aphrodite's son. And Psyche was supposed to be, she was a human mortal, but people were so jealous of her beauty that they actually compared her to Aphrodite. And she got punished bad <laughs> for that. It was kind of shit balance. Um... Yeah, you you guys are having a restoration within your life. So any partnerships, they're going to be balanced out. You're going towards fun times, passion, and playfulness. Look at the children. Look at the children. You guys could be having children if you don't want... Children! Fucking hell! Children is on the back! I cannot make it up. What is Pile 2's next big blessing? Oh my god, it's such a mess. Some of you are having kids soon. Like, that is just for sure, Okay blessings okay it's a surprise so the angel saying it's super blessings you're not gonna know everything but trust in us it's gonna be fun lit juicy wet and you're gonna really really like it it's coming in divine timing <laughs> awesome okay guys i really hope you enjoyed this um reading i really enjoyed it it was kind of fun so if you would like to see more videos like this hit the like button leave a comment subscribe all of the jazz and i'll catch you next time for some more divine wisdom okay Bye, everyone. <laughs>